Hello VUSD family. I am thrilled to share with you about some of the exciting things we've been doing in our Human Resources Development Division during the month of November. We've been focusing heavily on recruitment and retention efforts as of late. And I can share with you, this is something near and dear to my heart as a 15 year VUSD employee, because I know this is a great place to work. But I acknowledge that that statement is only as good as every individual employee's experience, which is why we've been focused heavily with our district leaders to build out our retention strategies focused heavily on extending and expanding the quality of our relationships with one another and the quality of our relationships with our students. If you are interested in joining our VUSD family, we would love to have you be a part of our team. Specifically, we're looking for some great individuals to come on as special education paraprofessionals, preschool paraprofessionals, or bus drivers. So if you or a member of your family or a friend that you know would love to be a part of our team, I encourage you to check out www.edjoin.org forward slash VUSD. Thanks everyone. Hey Visalia Unified, if you haven't noticed, we have officially entered the winter season. This time I wanted to take a few moments to talk to you about the work we are doing in our learning and leadership division. Our areas are currently busy going out to school sites supporting principals and teachers as they support students in their learning each and every day. If you didn't know this, we have over 700 students in preschool right now. The goal of that is to really focus on preparing them for kindergarten. Also, our winter seasons have kicked up in our VAPA and sports programs. If you want to check out some of these extracurricular events, check out the, your, your school's website uh, to find out more information about upcoming events. Finally, also, we continue to run our paper program, which is a 24-7 tutoring program for 4th and 12th graders. Check it out. Students can find that on their Schoology page. Last but not least, I want to encourage you during this winter season, as you have students at home more, is I encourage you to take a moment and read a book with your student. It'll go a long ways to, to build that love of reading in your student. As always, I hope you have a great day and have a great winter season. Good day, Visalia families. Today I wanted to share with you some important initiatives that we have planned which will result in a better educational experience for everyone. In Visalia Unified, we have established a set of core beliefs and commitments that drive the work we do. One of these beliefs states that the learning environments should be safe, supportive, and innovative. We know learning cannot take place in settings where children and staff do not feel safe. In response to this need, all school district employees will be receiving some very specialized training in disaster preparedness. With the support of the Visalia Police Department, we are partnering with a nationally recognized company to offer us the Alice 360 Active Shooter Training. This unique training campaign will see every member of our VUSD team taking part in a learning opportunity which will prepare them to respond appropriately in case of an emergency. We're all aware, unfortunately, of the tragic events that have taken place on campuses across our country. And while we hope and pray that we never have to experience anything like that on any of our schools, I want to be sure that our employees know what to do just in case. I will be offering more details on this endeavor the next time we meet. Happy November VUSD. A few highlights to share from our business services team this month. First, our student information system team began having uh, weekly office hours to share helpful tools and tips to navigate the power school system. Power school is where we track your students' attendance and we want to make sure that everyone has the latest info. Our payroll and budget teams continue to collaborate with our human resources friends as we look to improve our hiring processes and ensure that our position control and payroll is on track. And our purchasing team conducted a purchasing and contracting 101 with help from Lozano Smith. We were joined by our friends in operations and maintenance and they were updated on the new requirements for bidding and contracting for the new school year. Next time, look for an update on our 22-23 budget process and we'll see you then. Hello Vicel Unified. Today I'm going to give you a quick update from the operations division. First, we're excited to announce that work to convert the old Sherwin-Williams paint store to the VSD Music Shop has been completed. All instruments, storage, and repair have moved from the Oaks to that new location. Next, work continues on the district office remodel. We're currently working in HRD, and we plan to have this work completed by the spring. Third, the rollout for the Raptor Emergency Management System is continuing. District leaders and site administrators were given an in-depth demonstration yesterday at Mount Whitney High School. Work is also continuing on the rollout of the TransFinder transportation routing software with a proposed January rollout date. And finally, 
VUSD Maintenance has completed the refurbishment of the Gidding Street pedestrian bridge that connects Redwood High School with Sierra Vista. This will greatly enhance student safety as over 1,000 students use that bridge every hour. That wraps up this month's update. I'd like to wish everyone a safe and happy holiday season and we'll see you after the break.